shark populations are crashing around the world. Millions die by thinning to feed the growing demand for shark fin soup in Asia. Roughly a third of all shark and ray species face some threat of extinction. Without them, the marine food web could start to unravel. Marine biologist Luke Tipple is on a mission to protect sharks. We met up in the Bahamas. Actually, the marina that we're in right now was one of the first shark-free marinas in Bahamas. Sharks are an apex predator, which means they're at the very top of the marine food chain. They grow slowly, mature late, and produce few young, making them vulnerable to overfishing. We're supposed to have a certain number of sharks to be able to control all of these animals which are below them. So what we do is we take out that apex and we allow a lot of other fish to breed underneath them. They basically annihilate everything below them and that leads to trophic collapse which means uh, we don't have healthy ocean systems and we won't be able to pull food or product from there anymore. The Bahamas banned commercial shark fishing and that's helped lure more divers and tourist dollars to the islands. Coming back with both of these, all 10 of these. Luke and I jump in to see some sharks up close. Uh-huh. But outside of sanctuaries like this one, sharks remain at risk. 